Ray Give TV. It's Ray Give TV. Ray in here, bro. He just popped in. There it go. Somebody must have talked. Oh, you didn't know? I got the content. Click that bell, tune in. Okay, so check it out. WAC 100 reacts to J. Cole apologizing to Kendrick Lamar and reacts to Meek Mill and Wale's situation and flames Meek. What? I want to give a shout out to WAC 100, the whole 100 side spin the block. Let's get to the content. It's Ray Give TV. Spin the block. Niggas would have been came you. out. Niggas would have been came out and called him a fraud. I hear you. Go look at King Kunta. Them is all homies. And suits and shit. Them is homies. Niggas is in Campanella Park. But you wouldn't know that. Because you from Baltimore. You from actually, you just from Maryland. You ain't even from Baltimore. You, you from some outskirts. You ain't even from over there, over there. I can hear it well, in your voice. You a square nigga. All right, you so you saying, you saying, you saying Baltimore, square. hold up, whack, but you saying Baltimore is like the only official place in Maryland, which is not the case. If you from, if you know people from here, like people from PD County, give it up, niggas. Hey, bro, like, hey, bro, me. let me tell you something, bro. You telling me that shit? It's like you telling me motherfucking, uh, you know, where the Migos is from that way. Nah, them niggas That's why they from say Atlanta. That's why they I say used to, I used to talk to Shorty <laughs> who went to high school with the Migos. They from Lawrenceville. They from fucking yeah. Gwinnett County. Got that's it. a fact. So, but that's not don't what I'm talk saying, to me on this phone, on this app, like Baltimore ain't what the fuck it is. No, Wherever you talking about ain't Baltimore. But, no, what I'm saying. Wherever you're like, talking about ain't Baltimore. I'm from the DMV, which is that's a, but we know Virginia, what the right? DMV is, nigga. Okay, but, but we talking about Maryland Baltimore when it is, come down right. to the known ghetto, the known yeah. hot spot, yeah, nigga, PG. where it go down. I'm like Ten minutes from PG County, I'll be Listen, PG. You cannot My whole hey, life. give me one spot that supersedes Baltimore. I never say any place supersedes Baltimore. But okay, like, what you, but yeah. what you saying right now? But I'm now telling you that ain't where you're from, and you talking no, out your ass because you're listening to Kendrick's music, and you can't relate to what the fuck he's saying. And That's know not what, what I said. Saying. That's not even what I said. I didn't say. You I don't even know what he's saying oh, when he say certain shit. You don't know. So you don't know what that means. You don't know the significance to what he's saying when he say certain shit. Good, uh, uh, good kid, bad city. Where you think that house at? That's West Side Park Road. So, so what? What I was saying when was, it come to all them niggas, Kendrick is the most directly in tat and in tune with that. Correct. He's seen it all. They just made him go home. He show up to the funerals, bro, right now today. He can pull up over there in all the parks. I would not cool. doubt that at all. Now, I never said that. None of them niggas can't go pull up over there. It ain't gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. Pull hooks up. Yeah. Who, who the fuck is Clutchy or Clutch? Who was that? You see that nigga comment? Who was Clutchy or Clutch? Clutchy's a new guy. He, uh. Yeah, uh yeah, why he in, why yeah. it dissing hood niggas' hoods and shit? Yeah, yeah. He said some wild shit yesterday inside the uh, Good Burger room. Uh, J.O. caught him saying it. And uh, J.O. told him, hey, just check what you got to say. Don't be disrespecting hoods like that because we, yeah, we, 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 do we, we don't do that shit. We got a lot of hoods over here. Yep. Yeah, so. Cause next thing you go, they gonna start just disrespecting shit overall. This yeah, yeah, you already know that. So Jail checked him on that shit yesterday in uh, Good Burger. Hook to say he want to fade. He say he from St. Louis, Inglewood. He from St. Louis Six <laughs> <laughs> Hey Wack. Hey, hey Wack. We've been shit. asking a couple questions. Wack, how do you feel about an apology and a rap like a rap thing? 
You think that? It, what, what did you see that apology? That's Jay Cole, bro. You yeah, know, he can get away with that. He's pretty much say, because, bro. Unless I missed something, Kendrick didn't diss nobody. No, he didn't. He didn't. Right, and like he said, all my homies just calling the fans is all, all, all. What you gonna all, all, all? And he like the nigga just he dropped the bomb. The nigga said, "Fuck the big three, nigga. It's the big me." Now here go the problem. Right? Here goes the problem with that. And as a West Coast nigga, I'm going to speak on it. All artists could be big as a motherfucker, and they never put them where they supposed to be. Facts. For you to put J. Cole, Future, and Drake, and totally forget about Kendrick, nigga, he's supposed to say that. He's supposed to say that. They did the same shit with game. No matter how big an artist get, nigga, they never put them where they supposed to be. They did it with Dre. They did it with Cube. They did it with game. They doing it with Kendrick. Shit, even even too short. They, Tyler created he, too fast. They, they, them niggas is regional. Yup. Tyler, Tyler the credit. Yeah, Tyler. They never put them where they supposed to be. They they give them a mention, but they and we talking about when they and they prime. They never put them where they supposed to be. You get a nigga in New York get half a spark. Oh boy, that nigga's the king of everything. Hey, that's a fact. I what? wish we wrote for Jay Z ain't ain't outsold Kendrick yet. Let's keep it real. But he the goat. But they gonna put you. <laughs> the nigga got lines biting pin niggas, right? This is what they do. <laughs> What's the uh? What you think that is? Since y'all, you know that is. Bro, Hollywood. that's just what it is. Because is it just the influence. Because the buildings, the buildings is in New York. The blogs is in New York. It's just real shit. So Kendrick's supposed to say that. They go fuck the big three. They got just the big me. Cause they trying to be friendly with it. You heard the first song, right? You heard them niggas drinking. Man, and Kendrick it. shot at them niggas about eight years ago. That's what so I'm saying. That Jay Electronic and all them niggas. No, that was but ten it's years also, ago. Um, huh? It's that also unfortunate that he got to <laughs> do all that ago. just to cement his spot to some people. Like well, here go the thing. He ain't got to do all nothing. Nigga just said three, four bars. Two, three he bars. Three no, bars, whacking. It ended everybody. I say three bars and shake it. Then y'all might want to put him up there. Oh, no, I said that is. Come on, man. Every time Kendrick pop out, it's so crazy. When he say, might want to put him up there with the top stuff. Nigga said, if you make a, a sixteen whack, and then a nigga gotta go give you a whole mixtape in a response, you kind of gotta give the the edge to the nigga that did the sixteen only. You know what I'm saying? No matter what it was. So, I don't know, man. The whole tape wasn't about Kendrick, bro. The whole tape wasn't, but it was at least. Four songs that had subliminals in there. Crocodile Tears, Seven Minute For Drill. Sure. Was the uh, first three songs. Yeah, the first three yeah, songs. yeah, yeah. Crack, Crocodile Tears. I can name each song. And the last yeah. one, Seven Minute and Drill. And Seven Minute Drill was recorded. He admitted that he recorded that like last week, yeah, just to drop four. That, that's how it get cool, right? All his songs. What is this nigga Meek Mill crying over Wale? Oh, because he's king out with Dean. He kicked it with Dean at a WWE Man. match. So uh, Dean and him were seeing so, just a picture. Right, so he, uh, he wasn't even with this nigga me. crashing out People, like a bitch because everybody keep calling him gay. That's why. Y'all don't cut him out, man. Let's see what he's going to Uh, Meek Mill, little bitch. I ain't say nothing when you went and did a song with Game. Ooh. I ain't say nothing. I just say, nigga, you know, I ain't say nothing. So why you got a problem with Wale seeing a nigga? He ain't got a problem. So he's saying Wale supposed to have a problem with Dean because he got a problem with Dean. Me, you don't drive no car like that, bro. What do you guys think about J. Cole apologizing to Kendrick Lamar for his diss? What? That's different, man. Like, is he basically trying to say I'm humbling myself because I know I'm the best? Or is he cloud chasing off Jay-Z when he apologized to Nas? After they had their back and forth. I don't know. What do you guys think about the whole situation? It's your boy Ray Give. Drop a comment down below. Let's get back to it. At all. You do not drive no car. The men niggas don't fuck with you like that, bro. They fuck with your money. And you don't do it enough for them. 
that's crazy. So while they supposed to have a problem with me. He said, uh, for the last 10 years, nigga been like acting like he is homie and shit like that. And, and nigga never really fucked with him and blah, blah. So. All right, y'all friends, but like Wale's not a, uh, um, a, a gang bang street ass nigga. Like, what the fuck you, what do you want Wale to do? See, they got a little history of them too. Like, um, 10 years ago, he tweeted, he, but you know, before he did the shit with Drake, he did it with Wale when he said that Wale ain't tweet his album out and all that shit. Mm-hmm. He tried to, uh, he started some shit with Wale way back then, and then Wale he tried to shit with Drake. He should have tweeted his album out. He should have definitely tweeted his album out. He did, did though. Did he send Wale the assets? I don't know. Don't expect the nigga to go do all that work for you. Yeah. Exactly. I don't know if he did all that. But then he, he, he tried it with Drake. The same right. shit. Ever since Man, when he, he, tried, he tried it with Drake and shit. No, ain't there, right? Well, Mike, Cam, stop cutting him off, bro. What's wrong with you? Go ahead, man. Yeah. You know, he he tried to go to the good. Shit ain't been right since. I mean, if he sent the nigga the assets and all that nigga didn't put it out, cool. But can't expect the nigga to go do all the work. Send the nigga the assets, bro. I think that was the time in, uh, when the internet, it was just like a retweet. He was just asking for a retweet of his album. Oh, yeah. He definitely should have did that. He should have just did that. I ain't going to lie. No, he should have did that. They the same label. And that was back when MMG was dropping group projects and shit. And, and I give Meek Mill this. I'm not a Meek Mill fan. I actually dislike him back then. <laughs> but I got to give him this. He was tweeting them niggas' albums and shit. You know what I'm saying? So he was he was supporting them niggas, and they wasn't supporting him. So he was feeling the type of way. But like Bang said, he did the same shit with Drake. Like months later, he was like, oh, this nigga don't want to. Uh, I think they did a feature together or something, and Drake wouldn't post it or something like that. It was the same, same uh, situation. Yeah, he went in Drake was not posting his album. Yeah, same, same situation. I post my album. He just didn't mention it. He, he just mentioned the nigga, but he, he, he felt some type of way about Drake not tweeting that same album. Oh, so same album. So, yeah, yeah. And he, he just, just had mentioned it at the time. He went at Wale first, and then a couple of months later, he, he had mentioned Drake. But why are you trying to fight Wale? Like, out of all the rap, no, I, I don't think he wanted Wale to fight. Wale responded to there it. Just ratting, yeah, he need to go to sleep. This is what he, he said. Like Wack, he said, morning, Wale never sleep. liked me. Now I'm a treat. Now I'ma treat him like the streets every time I see him. I gave him a thousand chances. These guys be thinking they linking with the enemy, clown ass nigga. I wish I woulda knew the other day. I woulda stretched you. He wouldn't have did nothing. You gonna donate ten percent of your music proceeds to stopping the violence and shit. Now you now you promote nah, you more that's why that's why accent, academic said what he said. You know, now you just said the governor called and checked you. Right. The governor. That's what and I was about to say. Governor, what the governor got to say. This is the guy that's responsible for my homies, my friends getting killed. This nigga here. Well, I see this nigga need to stay up in there, bro. But then he wants to say he wants to start a war in these tweets that he's saying. He's saying he wa- so how are you going to go from wanting to, to, to snitching to now you want to start a war? He said, I'm at all. You see the tweets he's been tweeting lately, Wack? He's been tweeting some wild shit. Yeah, I put one in that yeah, shit. Like, Jug, you say he responded while they responded? Yeah, yeah while they while responded. Yeah. Respond. Hey, shit, nigga. He, he's he been going at me in the DM, come to find out. Him and RB went on a date four months ago. Hey, nah, yeah. Wack, nah. When'd you find this out on your birthday? Shut my birthday, bro. That's some. Sh- that, nah, nigga, nigga yo. Sent me a, picture, a picture, bro, of them at the MGM, bro. Yo, he damn. Oh, queen, we ain't doing that, Queen. I ain't even <laughs> fly with this nigga, bro. <laughs> I'm like, yo, what is, that's in the suite. Eating room service. She over there eating off a of fruit tray and shit. <sighs> Did she, she have the no W way, chain on? Wait, Did she yeah, have the wet? I was like, yo, what the fuck is this fucking lace panties doing hanging over the, 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 the edge of the seat? She said, oh, them was Meek Mills. He was trying them on. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, Damn. Nigga bird. <laughs> that nigga burned. Yo. Hit this nigga. Oh, oh what the fuck? Yeah. I went Damn, on a lot of people's hands. Those are them same ones he was wearing that did business. She tried to convince me she was on the business beat. What the fuck is you talking about? Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, it was a video of him just dancing a couple of days ago. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I 
don't trust She that said dude. I was I brought him a couple robes to try on. I'm like, so she like, baby, I ain't gonna lie, nigga wanna put on some thongs and lace. I just wanted to see if the nigga was gonna do it. I ain't gonna get no nigga no pussy wearing thongs and lace. I mean <laughs> Yeah, I pre well, why you didn't tell me this was man. going on? She said, because you might have wanted to come in and rob the nigga or something. I just wanted to see if the nigga won't do it. I got the content. There it go, vlog. Meek Mill had whack 100 woman in this week. And he was trying on thongs and lace panties. She brought the nigga the robes. Damn. I need. Hold up, hold up. Why is he going in on me like this? It's crazy. You guys think me gonna respond? What do you guys think about the whole situation between him and Wale? It's your boy Ray Gill. Let's get back to it. No, if this is a violation. That's what it's Ray Gill TV. Hey, on your birthday, too. What do you have to say for yourself, RB? He look good in life. Uh, man, oh man. When the Queen and RB get to going. The content will be contented for show. Salute to them, man. Shout out to the whole Hunter side, man. I appreciate everybody out there, man. Without y'all, there is no Ray Gift TV. Without the support of you guys watching this video right now, there is no Ray Gift TV. Let's make no mistake. We are a team. We are a collective. We are a community. You feel me? Like, we need each other for the views, for the content. We work hand in hand. You know what I mean? So with that being said, I appreciate everybody out there always tuning in. Even the people that don't like me in the comments, it's all good. You guys get mad at me because I might drop a throwback or two every now and again. But hey, I mean, I had to get rid of the videos a long time ago, but it's always good to bring them back. And when they're back on the channel, they're there for good. And it's done right this time. You feel me? I'm going to make sure the content's clean. We're going to present it in a nice in great fashion for people to enjoy it you know i hope you guys enjoy the content as much as i do but with that being said what did we learn from the situation between j cole and kendrick lamar they both found their shock value in what they're doing one came light one came heavy who you guys got as the winner i mean i got kendrick if you ask me that's just me though but what do you guys think about the whole situation i would love to hear it let me know what y'all think about Meek Mill and Wale. We'd love to hear that too. Please keep the notification bell turned on at all times so you don't miss out on no premium content. Shout out to the people, man. Salute. Keep your best foot forward. Make the most of your 24 hours. Stay down until you come up. Put some hustle behind that muscle and get to it. You feel me? Stay out the way. Say no to drugs. Stay out the streets. And live life right. And you will be blessed, man. But other than that, it's your boy Ray Kevin. I'm gone. God, God bless. Peace. Thanks for watching another reaction video. I'm out.